Dana, I want my whole head. <laughs> Holy cow. Yeah. Hey guys, my name is Dana and I'm a second year business student and this is my friend. I'm Montana, I'm a third year business student. And on today's vlog, we're going to be showing you around the beautiful city of St. John. St. John is New Brunswick's second largest city. It's the port city on the Bay of Fundy and it was Canada's first incorporated city. Cruise and container ships stop here from all around the world. And guess what? There's one here right now. And we know what you're thinking. This is where Robert Fooley invented the automated steam foghorn. <laughs> on the boardwalk where there's really awesome restaurants and a great atmosphere. There's always events happening here so you always have something to keep you busy. Absolutely and we even have great beach volleyball courts. So as you can tell from the buildings there's a lot of history here. There's plenty of modern shops too. And it's a super great place to be a student because there's so many restaurants, shops, and businesses in Uptown St. John. It takes literally minutes to go from walking uptown to on a beach on the Bay of Fundy. So while we're sitting here, there's a few unique aspects to these statues that a lot of people don't know about. Lucky for you, we have the inside scoop. This guy, he has three hands. Three of them. Three, not two, three. <laughs> Can you see them? You wanna see them? This is one, this is two, and this other one, right here, right here. So, is it an old man or is it a little girl? We don't know. We're not sure. Forever a mystery. Yeah. <laughs> so it looks like this guy's reading a newspaper, but he's actually having a cigarette. <laughs> this is a hawk. It's not a seagull. It's a hawk. So, as you can kind of see behind us, there is a mural, and as the tide goes out, more of it will be revealed. Unfortunately, we can't wait here for seven hours, so cue the time lapse. It was painted by a Hawaiian artist, Sean Hula Yarrow. He had to stand on a paddleboard and paint with the tides. He was sometimes here till midnight with a flashlight painting. Holy cow! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Montana, I'm a little parched. Are you? Yeah. You want to grab some coffee? I think that's a good idea. Yeah. So this is Java Moose. Java Moose is a company that was founded right here in St. John. It has several locations all across the province and even one in our St. John campus library. So now we've arrived at the city market. Let's go in. Did you know that this is the oldest continuing farmer's market in Canada? I didn't know that. It's open Monday to Friday and has all sorts of goodies like fresh produce, gelato, and samosas. There's handmade jewelry. Dana, I want my whole head. <laughs> These are my favorite ever. I love them. Searching for samosas. All kinds of samosas. Dana loves samosas. For those samosas? No samosas here. Samosas. <laughs> We're in Canada, remember? More samosas. <laughs> ice cream. Dana loves ice cream. I wish my head was in that, Dana. <laughs> So our next stop is super exciting, but Montana's scared of heights, so we're gonna leave her here. Bye. So now we're at the brand new Skywalk in St. John, and we're actually gonna be some of the first people to walk on it. So the St. John Skywalk is one of three in North America. It extends 28 feet over a 110 foot cliff. So it's been stress tested for 50,000 pounds. So here's hoping it holds me. Even though it's one of three skywalks in North America, it's the only one that looks over water, it's the only one in a city, and it's also the only one that's made out of stainless steel. Fun fact, the steel came from Fredericton. Thanks, Freddy. So the skywalk extends over reversing falls, and it's called reversing falls because when the tide comes in and out, the direction of the water changes. So let's go check it out.
So that's the vlog for today. Make sure you enter UMB's draw for free first year tuition. It's really easy. All you have to do is go to umb.ca slash win and sign up for the monthly Discover UMB news. Hey guys, it's Dana here with a little voiceover. We actually forgot to mention that we're also drawing random names each week from everyone who signs up for the Discover UMB news and sending them some cool UMB swag. And this week's winner is... Alexa Poirier. So congrats, Alexa. You've won yourself a UMB hoodie. Also, if you like this video, make sure you hit the subscribe button below so you don't miss our next vlog. Next week, we're <laughs> All right, so that's it for me. Thanks for joining us, guys, and we'll see you next time. And we know what you're thinking. This is where Robert Fooley invented the steam horn fog. <laughs> <laughs>